Once upon a time, in a remote, in a remote and desolate land, stood an ancient, stood an ancient fort that had long been abandoned. The fort, no fort, known as Fort Dreadwood, was shrouded in mystery and tales of horror. horror. Its dark and eerie presence sent chills down the spines of the spines of those who dared to venture near. Let it that Fort Dreadwood was built centuries ago by a tyrannical ruler who sought, who sought to establish his dominance over the land. The fort was strategically, strategically positioned on a hilltop overlooking the surrounding countryside, giving its occupants a clear advantage in times of, in times of war. However, the ruler's reign was short-lived, as he met a gruesome end at the hands of his own subjects who, rejects, who revolted against his tyranny. Forward, Fort Dreadwood became a place of dread and despair. Locals believed that the spirits of those who perished of those who perished within its walls haunted the fort, seeking revenge for their untimely, their untimely deaths. It was said that on moonlit nights, eerie nights, eerie whispers could be heard echoing through the corridors, and shadowy figures could be ears could be seen lurking in the darkness. One particularly chilling tale told of a group of adventurers who decided who decided to explore the forsaken fort. They were drawn to its ominous allure and sought to uncover its secrets. Secrets. Armed with torches and bravery, they entered through the rusted iron rusted iron gates, unaware of the horrors that awaited them within. Asterisk, asterisk, asterisk.